Super players, it's Roman C Rod, and in today's video, I'm gonna be going over Zenkai Series 3 and all the cards revealed. And just in case you don't know the name of this set, it is called Power Absorbed. And the theme around this set that's gonna be coming out very, very soon is all based on getting people's power. So we're gonna be seeing a bunch of awesome cards in this video, like a sick looking Vegito, and of course, Android 21, plus some secret awesome super spice. So definitely keep on watching, and let's just jump straight into all the hype for the newest Dragon Ball Senkai set. So I'm going to start off by talking about Android 20 and Dr. Mew. And of course, we're going to be having the Android 17 from the GT. So luckily for us, we're having support for Android 17 or Super 17. I know one of my best homies called La Ache loves Android 17. So now that we're going to be having a deck revolving around Android 17, it's going to be super duper hype. And it's going to be called Super 17 Onyx Lightning, the super rare. It's going to be a blocker. It's going to be able to get double strike, barrier, dual attack, and pressure. Green in Dragon Ball Super has, for the most part, not been heavily represented. Maybe Android 20 and Dr. Miu can do so. Let me know what you guys think about this Hellfighter 17 leader. So green is going to be a lot based on you know the androids and of course we cannot talk about the blue cards that are revealed and the blue cards are also themed around the androids but specifically the power absorbing android 21 from the video game dragon ball fighters let me know if you guys want to see me battle in dragon ball fighters i'll, I'll upload some videos i'm pretty darn good at it in my opinion but we got android 21 and it's sick because we got a brand new leader and what's even crazier is the super rare that you're probably going to have to play in the deck and it's called Android 21 Ceaseless Despair. Holy cow guys, this card is the nuts. This card should be a secret rare because of its ability. It, it has an ultimate ability. It has deflect. It has double strike. It has dual attack. It could be used as a combo since your Android 21 leader is going to reduce this combo cost. And on top of that, it kills barrier cards on the field, board wipes. And if your opponent activates a counter, you force them to discard cards and he switches or she switches all your energy back up. This card is what? Why is this card a thing? And Android 21 is pretty up there in the competitive scene. There was an Android 21 player in Nationals that was doing pretty darn good with just the Android 21 deck. So holy cow, I can only imagine how much buffness Android 21 is going to get. I'm pretty hyped. Supercati is probably hyped too because of the fact that we are going to be getting female characters. And this character just looks busted. And we got to also talk about some other hype let's just jump to another fence here and let's talk about one of the most hypest things for dragon ball which is called the dragon ball games battle hour 2023 we're going to be having it this year and luckily for your homie super play a sea rod i'm going to be able to go to the event because i signed up and i'm going to be trying my best to try to become one of the champions of this card game i there's going to be a total of 200 something players only able to get one last minute qualifiers to become one of the best players in the game and i did it because of the prizing holy cow the last championship qualifiers for the world championship they're going to be getting a gold secret rare kaioken sun goku highly collectible 100 percent you must get this card but i know most people won't be able to get it since only the champions of the actual event are going to be able to get it so first place is going to get the gold metallic ssb kaokin sun goku and the world champion is also going to be able to create their own card please let me create a card i would make a chocolate vegeto card 
and I will give it the ability to be able to do some crazy stuff. Let me know in the comment section below, if you were to win the world championship, what card would you create? Because Bandai is giving you the opportunity to create a card. I would build, I would create a chocolate Vegito. I don't know. I just, that's one of my favorite scenes in the actual anime. But on top of that, you also are going to be able to get yourself a stamped world championship Gohan Beast. If you manage to go to these events and of course other secret rares like the Bardock and on top of that there's the stamped Warriors of Universe 7 United as one and that card right here is just a high collectible card. I know it's 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 just collectible. I don't think it's going to be a, 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 a one that you're going to want to play because with the stamp on it you don't want to mess that card up. Go get that card graded and hopefully it comes back a 10 and you're you're sitting on some gold right there but the battle hour guys do not miss it tune in they're gonna be having a dragon ball card game section and hopefully your boy can make it crossing fingers if not tony g is also gonna be joining the tournament so hopefully one of us can make it i'm gonna be training hard and on top of that i don't know if you guys seen but you also get some exclusive goodies if you manage to have signed up for the battle hour event and one of those cards is this cool looking dragon ball games battle hour seven cost goku and vegeta card with the 2023 logo on it and it has a crazy effect where activate main for seven energies you and your opponent complement each other Woo! how awesome is that guys i'm gonna pay seven energies and you have to compliment me and if you don't I'm going to win the game, or I'm going to call the judge. Judge, he didn't compliment me. I activated Dragon Ball Games Battle Hour. I need a compliment or else I win. GG. <laughs> this is hilarious, right? But there's also other cool cards in there. So you definitely want to get these. These are just for collecting purposes. I don't think anybody's really going to be playing all these cards that just force you to compl compliment each other. But those are cool goodies that you get for joining the event. And... Uh, they completely look boss, in my opinion. They look hella boss. So, moving on to some other cards that are going to be in the new set called Power Absorbed. We got Android 18, of course, because, you know, she, she is an Android and she gets her power absorbed by Cell. And moving on to the yellow, we also have Majin Buu that's going to be coming out in this set and Majin Buu leader is going to have a Z awakening and a bunch of these new decks that are coming out in this set are having Z awakening so that's that new game mechanic in Dragon Ball where after you combo you could throw out energy in your Z energy and it allows you to bring out Z cards and Z awaken so uh, I'm pretty hyped for the Buu the Buu looks pretty darn cool uh, it's able to KO stuff that is in rest mode and that's right there is pretty sick because it could also do it ignoring barriers so that's 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 a pretty awesome ability in my opinion the more the game comes out the more i'm realizing uh barrier removal is becoming more highly prevalent but on top of that since we're going to be getting a majin buu you already know there has to be vegeto because goku and vegeta combine and they make vegeto now i'm pretty darn hyped for this vegeto guys i am extremely hyped because of the fact that you know it's our first yellow leader vegeto if i'm not mistaken and uh, this vegeto is going to be running a bunch of goku and vegeta cards and these guys are going to be coming out for little to no energy so you're going to be able to spam goku and vegeta's out and attack and pressure and these guys are double strike holy cow i cannot wait I cannot wait for that, guys. The Vegito Onslaught is going to be coming around. And you already know your boy C-Rod is going to be playing that. And talking about the Vegito Awesomeness. I don't know if you guys heard about the secret rare that was just revealed called You Are Number One. It has a cool looking artwork of Vegeta in it. And the effect is all based on Goku. Pretty much... If you activate this card, you're going to be able to bring out a Goku that gains triple strike, a power boost, and can attack twice with dual attack. It is nuts. It's crazy how you have a Vegeta picture, yet you have a uh, Goku taking the shine ability. But it's because this secret rare right here represents the moment where Vegeta acknowledged that Goku is 
more powerful than he is in the anime. Shout out to my Instagram fans for letting me know that was the picture. And let's move on to one of the hypest things that is here, which in my opinion is the black. Now, the black was one of the first things that they revealed in this set. And guess who is going to be representing the black in this new set? Your boy, your boy, Cumber, guys. Cumber, the the guy that's, you know, wrapped up because he's crazy. He's the crazy Saiyan. He's coming out and he has a Z Awakening as well. And I'm guessing his deck is going to be revolving around the Servant ability where you have heavy battle cards that are able to attack with high boost and then they stay in rest mode and of course it's going to be heavily themed so you're going to be getting cards like foo and uh the planet of the evil xenoverse so i mean i'm hyper cumber are you hyper cumber there's a lot of cool leaks that well they're not even leaks reveals that ba that bandai has done what is your favorite I'm hyped for the Battle Hour, I'm hyped for the Cumber, I'm hyped for the Vegito, I'm even hyped for the Android 21, guys. And there are going to be more reveals, I'm guessing the red archetype that I have not seen yet, because they haven't revealed it as of this video, is going to be based on Jiren, just because we have this cool Jiren promo. And, of course, we might get more support for Universe 11. And, Jiren, Jiren, Jiren. and that's pretty much all I got with the reveals. Those are some of the hype that I thought. And let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Are you guys hyped for the new set, Powers Absorbed? I'm still waiting on a trailer. I'm still waiting for more awesome secret rares to be revealed. But that's going to be it. Call it a wrap. And like we always say, y'all stay super. Peace out, guys.